That is a new Volkswagen Tiguan Allspace. It's basically just a regular Tiguan, only bigger. It's kind of like how you can get the same phone, but just in a larger size. That also means it's more expensive. So what does the Allspace come with that the regular Tiguan doesn't? What are its cool features? And what's it like to drive? Let's go and meet it. Now, just looking at it, it looks really, really similar to a regular Tiguan. You can tell the difference though, because the Allspace has got this sort of stepped up bonnet. It's also got, I don't know if you can see it, these ridges which run along the roof. And it's longer, it's 215 millimeters longer. It's also got a bit longer wheelbase than the regular Tiguan too. And that means that Volkswagen has been able to put in a third row of seats. Yeah, the regular Tiguan only seats five, the Allspace sits seven. So what's that third row like to sit in? Let's see. It's not that great. Not if you're 191 centimeters like me. Um, my head is hitting the roof and I can't feel my legs. Uh, the second row is on rails though and it can be slid forward but that does also reduce your your leg room in the second row. Let me show you the boot. I'm in so much pain. <laughs> okay, look, I am tall. If your kids are as tall as me, then it's time for them to move out of home. Now, the boot. All, all spaces come with this gesture kick function, which works 50% of the time. No, it doesn't, it's just me. Now, these seats fold down very simply like that. And you've got 700 litres of space. Regular Tiguan's only got 615. That's really, really big for the class as well. Also, cool feature, a little torch. How cute's that? Let's check out the second row. Okay, the second row. Now, as I said before, I'm 191 centimetres tall, which is pretty tall for a human being. This seat's in my driving position, and look how much room I've got. That's outrageous, that's magnificent for this class. Headroom is also really, really good here too. These are on rails, so you can give the people behind you a little bit more space as well. Cool features, check out these overhead storage boxes. They are, they are great too. You've also got these cool little tray tables and climate controls in the back. Now, let me just point out how big this doorway is. That is like a bank vaults doorway. It's enormous, that makes getting in and getting out just so much easier. Let me show you the front. Okay, front seats. Now, I've got something to tell you. Uh, there are two grades in the Tiguan Allspace lineup. You've got the top of the range high line and you've also got the entry level comfort line. Now, all of them come with these overhead storage boxes, but the comfort line also comes with drawers under that seat and under this seat too. The high line actually doesn't get those, but what the high line gets that the comfort line doesn't get is this 9.2 inch touchscreen. The comfort line gets an eight inch, which is also great, but this is, this is beautiful. Um, all of them though come with Apple CarPlay and Android Auto, sat nav, a reversing camera. Uh, Highline gets a pretty nice interior, it gets leather seats. This has got the R-Line package, so it gets these R-Line embossed seats and the R-Line body kit around the car as well. Uh, but it's a very, very nice interior and it's also very, very similar to the Tiguan, the regular Tiguan's interior. In fact, it's almost, almost identical. Let's take it for a drive. As I told you before, I'm in the Highline, it's the top of the range grade. This is the petrol model, it's the most powerful petrol model you can get in the Allspace range. It's 162 kilowatts, it's the 162 TSI. You can also get the most powerful diesel in this grade as well. Now, you can't get those engines in the, in the Comfort line, it comes with two petrols and a diesel. Uh, they're lower powered engines, but they're still, they're still pretty good. You read my full review at carsguide.com.au and you'll, you'll get the, whole, the full lowdown on, on those. What's the 162 TSI like to drive? Well, I loved it uh, in, the, in, the, in the regular Tiguan guys. Uh, zero to 100 in 6.5 seconds in that, in that five-seater Tiguan. This, it's heavier and it's bigger, uh, but zero to 106.8, it's, that's still pretty darn quick. Steering, light. Um, it's a little bit too light for me. You can firm that up a bit in the settings. Uh, Suspension, really good. Again, on this uh, 162 TSI Highline, uh, you've got adaptive uh, chassis control, so you can firm up the suspension and soften it too. Uh, 
I am really enjoying it. Now there's only one variant of the Allspace which is not all-wheel drive and that is the very, very base comfort line with the 110 TSI engine. The rest of them have Volkswagen's 4Motion all-wheel drive system. Now the Allspace is longer than the regular Tiguan and you, you, you can feel that extra, you know, that extra bit of size. It's not, it's not nothing to worry about, uh, but yeah, it's it is a little bit noticeable. Only for me though, because I've driven both. If you haven't driven the other one, then you're obviously not going to notice. Visibility. Visibility out the front is excellent. And it's with those larger rear windows in the back, visibility out the back is great. Actually, it's better than the regular TIG one. Okay, safety stuff, which I reckon is pretty cool as well. Now, all Allspaces come with AEB, which operates at highway speeds and city speeds. There's lane keeping assistance and auto parking. Now, the higher grade, the high line, comes with more safety features. There's emergency assist, which is fantastic. How it works is if your, if your hands drop off the steering wheel while you're driving, it will beep at you, and if you still don't respond, it will jolt the brakes to try and wake you up. Let's just say you've, something terrible has happened, like you've passed out. Now if that still doesn't work, the hazard lights are activated and the car will pull itself up in its lane. That, that is amazing. Pricing. Okay, now depending where you are and when you're watching this, pricing can vary. But as a general rule, the Allspace is about three grand more than the regular Tiguan. And prices for the Allspace range range from about $40,490 up to about $54,490. You know, I reckon the regular Tiguan is pretty unbeatable for a five-seater mid-size SUV, but the Allspace is just more of a good thing. The third row of seats and the extra boot space. It's priced well, and it looks pretty darn good too.